Hey, kiddos. It's bedtime with Bo and Lucy the lamb. Tonight's bedtime story was another choice from Bo. And of course, it's about bears. It's called Milk and Cookies. And it's written and illustrated by Frank Ash. One winter day, the bear family went to visit grandma and grandpa. When it got to be late, too late to go home, grandma made up the couch for them in the living room. Good night, said grandma and grandpa. Good night, said mama and papa. Good night said Baby Bear, and they all went to sleep. In the middle of the night, Baby Bear heard a noise and woke up. Then he saw a strange red light coming from under the cellar door. He climbed out of bed and tiptoed to the door to see what it was. He didn't want to make any noise, so he just peeked through the keyhole. What he saw looked like a giant dragon with flames shooting from its mouth. Grandpa was there, feeding it. When the dragon shut its mouth, Grandpa came upstairs. Is there anything wrong? asked Grandpa. No. I'm okay, said Baby Bear. Would you like some milk and cookies? Asked Grandpa. No, thank you, said Baby Bear. And he went back to bed. That night, Baby Bear dreamed that the cellar door opened and the dragon came upstairs. I'm hungry, said the dragon. Baby Bear ran into the kitchen and opened the refrigerator. He poured the dragon a glass of milk and opened a box of cookies. Thank you, said the dragon. I like milk and cookies. And he ate everything all up. He didn't save any milk or even one cookie for Baby Bear. Just then, Baby Bear woke up crying. Mama and Papa Bear woke up too. Baby Bear told them his dream. Whatever gave you the idea that there was a dragon in the cellar? Asked Mama Bear. I saw it, said Baby Bear. If I come downstairs with you, asked Papa Bear, will you show me the dragon? Okay, said Baby Bear, and they went downstairs. In the corner where Baby Bear thought he had seen a dragon, there was a wood stove. Papa Bear opened the door. Inside, the flames glowed brightly. There, you see, said Papa Bear, there's no dragon in the cellar, just an old wood stove. When they went back upstairs, Grandma and Grandpa were up. Is everything all right? asked Grandma. It is now, said Papa Bear. Good, said Grandpa. Let's all have some... Milk and cookies. That's it for now. But it's not the last bedtime story that we are going to read together. Bo, Lucy, and I love each and every one of you. 
we wish you sweet dreams, warm snuggles, and peaceful sleep. And we can't wait to see you back here next time. Good night.